This was another one of those moments, probably one of the biggest moments in, in my career. You know, we went into the end of the year uh, riding high um, with um, a real uh, sense of optimism and some big ambitious plans um, going into 2020. We had just um, finished wrapping up a exciting merger with New York uh, Media, which brought together um, the the incredible portfolio of Vox Media and the incredible portfolio of New York Media. So on a dime, we had to take the ambitious plans of, of going into 2020 uh, that involved, um, you know, the fruits of this uh, merger and a combined workforce, um, you know, a big amb amb ambitious plans for our studio business, et cetera, you know, that were contingent and dependent on, you know, uh, facilities that we had just finished building out, et cetera. And, you know, we had to adapt. One of the most difficult challenges we had to overcome was the fact that, you know, a big part of our business is our studio and podcast um, business where, you know, we have purpose-built facilities um, and, you know, creative talent that are, are working to produce um, long-form and short-form video. You know, we, you've probably seen them on, you know, Net Netflix or, um, you know, PBS. Honestly, what, what I'm most proud of is that in reality, the needs of our customers, our internal needs, um, and our expectations actually didn't change at all uh, when the world went online. We we were still expected to provide the same um, select uh, solutions and service that we um, had been providing in the past, and that actually is the work. That is the work of of engineering and technology and creative teams in general, which is to find a way forward in in the face of of challenges. I think that we were primed to meet this moment um, for a couple of reasons. Um, first of all, um, to meet any sort of challenge, you have to have what I would just call a culture of helpfulness, where uh, folks like from a their a foundational sense um, feel that they are there to help get things done. For us, that translates into working with partners um, that are really, really uh, geared towards providing uh, platforms to build upon. Um, really giving, making sure that we have uh, the um, hooks to build with. You know, we saw that, you know, in Fastly, you know, seven or eight years ago when we first um, uh, uh, started working with them as a partner, um, that through their API-driven approach, we were going to be given the tools we needed to build what we needed to do and change what we needed to do um, as much as we could. And um, and that's uh, has really helped us during um, this last phase because, well, that's what we needed to survey across the board. What do we need to change? How quickly can we make that happen? And when you have the right tools, well, you know, suddenly it's possible. Fastly really is the business delivery network for uh, Vox Media. Every, just about every connection we have with our audience of millions and, you know, the audience for our customers and partners, you know, is mediated through uh, the Fastly network um, and their first Point of contact is through Fastly, um, so we'd absolutely depend on uh, you know Fastly service um, to uh, deliver our business. Not only were we able to do the work that we needed to do in response to the you know changing environment, um, but we are also to when 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 possible to continue with our, our thinking about the future. And you know that's what's really exciting. You know to be to be talking about computed edge here is because you know I think. Well, we all we all want things to turn around, and when it does, um, uh, we're ready to we're we're excited to meet the future, and we think Parsley Parsley is going to be a big part of that for us. Well, we're really proud of one just being able to you know keep and improve business operations during uh, during this pandemic. Um, as I mentioned, to you know continue to uh, create um, amazing uh, podcasts and and uh, video productions, as well as you know, still uh, and meet our audience of millions uh, through our um, online portfolio of brands. So that is what makes me most proud. But, you know, we continue to build as well. Um, and that's really exciting, too. 